Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. This is going to be a reading for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please remember to take what resonates and don't manifest the rest. Pisces. Alright, so the projection is real here. Whatever somebody's projecting at you, it's real. And somebody asked me, when is this going to end? And I'm like, I don't have an answer. I wish I had an answer. Somebody also left a message or left a comment saying, the entities you channel are something else. I feel sorry for you. Well, these ain't entities. These are people. Okay? These are just the collective. They're people. Entities are a whole different ball game. And if we go there, yeah, we'll go there and, and you'll see the difference. So this high priestess, my guess is in reverse, uh, is practicing magic on you, Pisces. Trying to tempt you to get you to take the bait. This could be somebody from your past they're they're really trying to affect your stability your growth your you know everything that that you you're trying to build so it's like an uphill battle with these mofos all right it is an uphill battle pisces and you're just gonna have to kind of hang in there because these these people are gonna try to the bitter end they're in most likely I do feel like somebody's very ill. Yeah. Trying to make you juggle your pent pentacles. Make you not be able to uh, do anything possibly online with the Seven of Cups and the Moon here. Anything that has to do with this. Uh, I got a masculine here that, that wants to uh, fight you. Male or female, they want to fight you, Pisces. They want to fight you, period. Fight you for love, fight you for money, fight you for whatever they can because it's an illusion. And they, but you've been, you've been uh, exposed, and they're doing their best to block, stop, and drill. This is, this is his story. Is getting so old, spirit. Please make them stop. Because this is just ridiculous. They're trying to get you to accept less than what you what you deserve, Pisces, which is your divine counterpart. A king of cups that's just now realizing who you are, but they're stuck in a relationship with a karmic, uh, a karmic situation that looked good on the outside, but there it was an illusion. Now they're in a fight with that person. So they're coming towards you in that very aggressive energy. And I want you to be aware of that. They're just aggressive because they're projecting. They're projecting on you. Could be a Gemini. They're, they're, yeah. I'm hearing they can't fix things at home. So they're going to try to forced to fix things with you and if not they're going to try to take you out and humiliate you and try to make you climb uphill in the snow with bare feet no shoes on uh to make you fight for your position in this world because you don't you you've exercised your free will you you chose not to choose at this time you're magical right now and you're making things happen and spirit has got you okay i know it's hard to hard to believe because of what's happening here you cut somebody off you you know i pisces there's the queen of cups and the queen of swords here so you cut somebody off you might even block them spiritually in in many different ways some specific contract here that somebody wanted you to enter into because you said no they're coming at you because you you cut it you cut them out you're like yeah no um I'll, I'll be all right i'll figure it out 
And that's what you're doing here, Pisces. And it's also your challenge. If you don't want this person, you don't want this person. And it's as simple as that. You are concentrating on your north node. What is right for you? This person wants to give you what they think is right for you. This queen of pentacles. I'm going to give you what I think is right for you. So you take a step down from that ten of pentacles. That you are trying to bring to life. Or the four of wands. I'm going to tell you who you should marry. I'm going to tell you who you should live with. I'm going to tell you what you should settle for. Don't do it, Pisces. Somebody wants to make you a wife here and be fair to you. But do they? I mean, you're, you're standing there and you're nine of wands with everything you got at this point. Defending your home. Defending your four of wands. Defending what you have. Because whoever these people are, they want to tell you what you need. Instead of you deciding what you need. This is the worst way to come at a Pisces. I don't know who you are out there. But this is this is the way to get a Pisces. You want to see a Pisces fight? Smother them in a bag. Well, they'll fight you alright. They're fish. They will fight their way out until there is no fight left in them. And if that's what you're trying to do, good luck. Because they are some of the most patient signs, too. Like I said, wanting to win at all costs. They want your old ten of pentacles. I knew I was feeling that. This is a cancer. This is somebody who's coming towards you, Pisces, to give you this. To, to, to give you what's owed to you. And whoever these other people are, they are desperately trying to stop it by tempting you into a situation that's not good for you. This is a, a got Cancer and Taurus energy with Virgo and um, Gemini. Pisces. Could be another Pisces. This is somebody who's trying to force you into submission. And then there's, there's somebody else here who's coming to try to offer you something that is going to be awesome whatever these people are trying to work out it's being blocked by the truth by your truth by the cold hard truth and yes the confusion is about to end whatever there are two of swords and at you two of pentacles at you it's about to be over my lovelies because, believe it or not, they're going to they're gonna fight you to their death. And it's sad to say that. But it's they want to win at all costs. They don't, they don't even care that this is going to cost them dearly. They just want to win. But you're, you know, you standing in your truth there with that seven of wands going bad about a swing. Your truth is what's bringing in some kind of collaboration, some kind of a, a new project or something like that. And this is what they're trying to stop. They, they don't want to, something about your innovation, your creativity. They want to stop that. They want to stop you from having that. Look. Death card to the Ten of Pentacles. That's their hope. Is that they can put an end to you. Before you get this. Because how dare you. Be above them. Because they want to make you take what they want to give you. Scorpio energy. Yeah, so like I said, this person is obsessed with putting pressure on you, Pisces, and making you settle for way less, way less. 
And they feel like if they keep attacking, keep attacking, keep attacking, you'll take this chump change offer. Could be from a Virgo or a Capricorn, but whoever this person is, they are completely and undeniably obsessed with you. And that's why they're coming at you so hard, my babies. Because people don't rob empty houses. Your house, your four of wands. And they want to take that from you. They're willing to bet their life on it. Good luck, whoever you are. Good luck with that. What is this high priestess? I wish I had a better reading for you, Pisces, but damn, you know? The projection is real, and they are really trying to get you to accept less than you deserve here. For what reason? For their own greed and, and, and bullshit. For their own greed. Yeah, so like I said, they're doing this because they're about to be exposed. They're stressing really, really hard because they know the truth is about to come out about them. That's why they want to get you to sign a contract. And they'll be generous to you. Really? Sign a contract with the devil? For what? So I can have a six of pentacles instead of a ten of pentacles? Fuck off. I'm patient. I'll wait. I'll figure it out till then. Two of pentacles, knight of wands, eight of cups, yup. So this is somebody who's in and out of your life anyway. Aquarius. I feel like this star is choosing you. Pisces. Two of pentacles, yeah. They want to keep you juggling. Keep you from moving forward, queen of cups. Look, you're going to find out who this is, Pisces. You're going to find out very, very soon who this possibly cancer is that wishes you to be sad and lonely and, and, and uh, depressed. They've made, a, they've made a serious error here. A serious error. Whoever this person is, they walked away from a queen of wands that they were holding on to. But this queen of wands is still in their energy. And it's, that's, that's who's really messing with you here. That's the one that's doing the magic. They walked away from them. So now this, this Queen of Wands thinks that they're going to control the narrative and tell you what you're going to settle for. It's like somebody's trying to ne negotiate with you in the ethers before it even gets on the ground. And, and, and this is your creative spark. This is your creativity. This is your glow up. This is your shine. And they're trying to tell you what you deserve. You only deserve this much. Because whoever this other person is, they walked away from them. And they're big, they're big mad. So they're trying to block any movement forward or any progress for you. They want you to settle for less. They want you to sign this contract with the devil. And spirits over here going, uh, mm, mm don't do it. He's like, you might, it, it, this is, this reminds me of the 40 days or whatever it was, 40 nights that Jesus was being tested. That's what this reminds me of. You rest, Pisces. You get your rest. You you do what you need to do because these people want to see you fall. 
This person also wants to transform your life, but at their at their control. But the devil. The devil wants to control everything. So this person wants to control you and tell you what you're gonna get instead of you getting what you deserve. Six of Pentacles. Six of Pentacles, my ass. Yeah. So, like I said, this person could be... Now, I, I have a big problem right now with my internet. And I, I found hidden user on... Or hidden... What was it? A hidden... What do you call it? A hidden line. It's on my computer. There's no way I can get away from it uh, unless I just stop doing videos or use my phone and my phone's tagged too. So understand that these creatures are all on your phone. They're all on your internet. They're all on your your PCs. And 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 when you get rid of them, you just get more. So so. They're little creatures and, and, and they're dark little things and they listen to everything you say and they listen to everything you do and they think that, you know, um, by jacking all your stuff that they'll get you to submit because they're secretly doing this behind the scenes in your home and you're about to find out about it. It's a betrayal in your own home. They're trying to end your four of wands, Pisces. They want to take this from you. Because they want it. Not for any other reason. And they're willing to go away for it. And I do mean go away. I do feel like it's this Queen of Wands. I don't know why. It's like some, like I said, this is like a, a famous contract, you know, like, like, you know how, uh, oh, it's, what's a good example? In the K-pop industry, to become famous, they sell out, they sell their souls, and they barely get enough money to live on. Not they get their living expenses taken care of and they barely get any spending money. They don't get a whole lot. But they're the wheel that drives the whole thing. So without them there would be nobody making money. And in the industry it's the same way. And this is this is what this reminds me of is the Hollywood industry where you work your ass off for two years making a movie and they make all the money and give you what they want to give you. Okay? That's exactly what this feels like. They want to kill your hopes and dreams of this Ten of Pentacles. And I do feel like that Ace of Swords is in reverse. I think they're finding out that... Um, their magic is really going to cost them. <laughs> this is a typical what goes around comes around scenario here. This magic is going, you're going to see it. You're going to be a witness to all these secrets in the immediate future. And it's going to be over for these people. That's why they're trying so desperately to get you to sign this contract, Pisces. Because they know that their time is up or about to be probably by the full moon on the 24th. But I, don't quote me on that because Saturn doesn't come back visible until the 28th, which is. And that means that all these little dark, creepy, crawly things are still going to be there for a couple of weeks, my babies. They are being blocked by some kind of truth, by some kind, could even be a legal situation they can't get past. Because you have to sign this contract. 
There's no way they can get around you not signing this contract. They're very burdened by it. They want to win at all costs. But this is what you have coming towards you, Pisces. They want to stop it. They want to take it from you. They want to break your heart. We have an emperor here. This could be your own business, Pisces. It's a lot of work. And like I said, this is this, they, this is, could be like, like I said, it could be like uh, Hollywood where they're trying to get you to settle for jump change when they're really just playing you. When you're, you're already your own boss, I'm the boss of me. And they are definitely trying to affect your money. Definitely trying to affect your money. They want to make you beg for help is what I'm hearing. You don't have to beg for anything, Pisces. As long as you got a roof over your head, food in your belly, and uh, a good heart. Because they are doing that too. I feel my heart being squeezed. It's like somebody's in there. Trying to squeeze it from the inside out. Trying to give me a heart attack. You can't do it because um, I pay attention to such things. Alright, so this Knight of Wands is about to send you a message. If you haven't gotten it already. This person that's in and out your life. Wants to offer you a cup. I don't think you want it. But their wish is to make you take it. Or they're going to destroy you. <laughs> with magic. With an illusion. And, and Pisces understand that it's an illusion. And if you don't believe that, go get yourself a little red string and tie it around your wrist. If you believe in magic, then you'll believe that this is protection. You can either believe in it or you could push it to the wayside. And I do feel like most of my Pisces do believe in it because they make their own magic. They want to get you to walk away from fame, fortune, whatever, and take whatever chump change offer that they're given. Oh, they're coming in fast. They're really reckless right now, Pisces. Trying to paint this illusion real quick. They want to make it happen. <clears throat> really quick. Oh, my God. Aries energy. They want you to be foolish and choose the illusion, Pisces. <coughs> I do feel like there's at least three people here. And they're going to try to keep their secrets, but it's not. It's all going to come out. It's all going to be exposed. And you're going to see just who these people are. Like I said, I wish I had better... I wish I had better... Better news. I'm getting tired of this story. It's getting old so fast. And yeah, I'm frustrated as you are. I guarantee you, I'm getting messed with it mu as much, if not more, because I am in the public eye. And I know who these people are. I know what they want. I know who they are. And I'm not taking their chump change offer. Or their help. Because they, they don't help. They destroy. They work with the devil to try to interrupt and take away things from other people for their own personal gain. And that's what the high priestess needs to know. The answers are within on who this page of pentacles is and what they're offering. What they're actually offering. Which is a ten of wands, not a ten of pentacles. It's where you take on all the responsibility and they make all the money. Not today, Satan. Fuck off. 
opportunist much. And that's all this person is, is an opportunist. A clout chaser. I think I said that in Scorpio's video too. Yeah. Ten of Cups, Page of Pentacles, wait, Pisces. Wait. Something else is coming. It's going to tear all this shit down. Wait for a solid, real offer before you sign any contracts with this with this chump. Alright? They want to control you, Pisces. They want to control what you say. They want to control what you do. And they feel like if they... If they give you an offer of a little bit, that you'll take it because you're tired of fighting. Well, you know, um, yeah, I'm tired of fighting, especially the ghost in the machine because that's just, to me, that's just chicken shit. Uh, so, yeah, I'm tired. But you ain't taking anything you ain't already taken. All right, energy harvesting from the enemy. This person, you're almost there, Pisces. Stand in your truth. Be your authentic self. And you can't, you can't go wrong. They're using fear to bind you. Fear and your wounds to keep you bound to a support system. Because you're alone. This could be a twin flame. Don't have to be. But if this is love, I would hate to see what they do to people they dislike. Gossip. Trying to affect your vibration. Trying to take away your identity. Gaslight you. Gaslight you into giving up your, your spot, your confidence. Little do they know that you're not you might be alone but you're not a loner you might be a loner but you're not alone this shit will be reversed you just have to be patient my babies because this this is strong and it's coming from more than one person this is like tag team action this is like people coming at you double like like a masculine and a feminine because i just want to get a man they just want to they want to take your identity. They want to take who you are as a person, as a being, and turn it into a profit for themselves. This is this is it. This is what they want. They want you to sign this contract, Pisces. And they want to give you what they they want to stop you from growing. They want to stop your memory. They want to make you give up paradise. They want to. They want you to put all your cards on the table, and not transform into your highest self. They don't want you talking anymore, Pisces. They want to shut you up. You're revealing stuff here that is re that that is showing their true colors, and they want to shut you up by any means necessary, because they're karmic. Let go of them, Pisces, and forgive them, because they're dumb. They are karmic as fuck. Even if they're a rock star, I don't care what this person's got. I feel like whatever they got is about to be taken away from them, and they know it, and that's why they're trying to get you to sign this contract. Because you, they know that you're probably the one that's going to receive it because of all the shit that they've been doing to you. This is like like it, it, it's like a, a never-ending loop unless you close out the loop, Pisces. And I do feel like that's what needs to be done here. You need to shut this down. You need to cut ties. Do not reach out to this person. Do not talk to this person, if at all possible. And do an uncrossing ritual. And change the game, Pisces. Because these people are hanging on to your energy with everything they got because they're vampiric and they, they don't know no better. And there's nothing you could say to this person that's going to change their mind or these people because it's a whole community. Somebody could even be a politician or, or somebody of that nature. Somebody's held in high regard here. 
but it, it, and it's a main male who may have or, or, or may be passing away or may be on their way okay and this whole community of people want to stop you from shining they want to shut you up they don't want you telling anybody what, what time of day it is especially you Pisces they, like I said they don't think you deserve this they think you deserve whatever they're wanting to give you as opposed to what is coming towards you and they want to stop it from happening you can't stop the divine and Pisces you already know in your heart of hearts and with your intuition that this is going on and that is why it is so hard like I said climbing up the mountain in the snow with no shoes on for miles and then they're trying to get you to drink the Kool-Aid so if they keep doing it over and over and over again and I feel like they are because like I said they're willing to check out for this so it must be big it must be huge they're trying to affect your heart do not drink poison do not do things that are bad for you. You know this is going to be bad for you if you try. Law is not justice, and that's in reverse. So they're doing something seriously illegal here, and they know it. Who in the world are you? Getting to know the new you. They're, they're, they they want to know who you are. They want to know why, you, why you're not succumbing to their whims. It's because you are a part of the fairy energies. And the flower energies. You are an elemental. Possibly an immortal. So you belong into your own dream here Pisces. Creating your own life. Becoming braver. And trying to lead the way. Although it can feel a bit distorted. Being a leader. Show Show others how it's done. You can help others. Pisces, leading by example. I say this all the time. No matter what you're up against here, do not drink the Kool-Aid. They want you to forget who you are and fall and descend back into the third dimension. So you can't speak your truth and you can't be who you are. That is their only trajectory. These dark little things. You guys need to watch my uh, general because I, I was explaining a dream that I had last night. In fact, I'll just go ahead and tell it to you. The dream that I had was like I was in this room full of all these, all these magical beings, magical creatures and stuff. And... Um, there was these witches in there and they were plotting and scheming to cause anarchy and and to take people out and stuff like that well I spoke up well, that didn't make them very happy so one of them tried to come at me flattened herself against the floor I mean she was just a big black ink spot of a human and she flattened herself against the floor and she calls comes up to my chair and she creeps up the chair and she tries to get inside me by you know like crawling up me <laughs> and I grabbed her by the legs and by the head and I tied her in a knot and then I tied her in another knot tossed her in the closet he <laughs> <laughs> nobody got time for that <laughs> get out of my way don't climb on me don't touch me Typical Pisces, unwanted attention. <laughs> they don't know how strong that is till they try it. <laughs> and I do feel like this is what this is, Pisces. It's unwanted attention in your eyes. They're trying their damnedest to make you give in. Try to make you drink the Kool-Aid. Working too hard. Absolutely, you are working too hard. But you know that your work is not done. It's in reverse. 
these people want accolades without the work so whatever work that you're putting in right now Pisces they want to take the credit for it the signs are with you already be your true self and break dawn baby a powerful energy energy shift is happening this is what they're trying to get you get you to stop is your lotus from opening up Pisces your lotus from opening up so you can see them coming at you and be a leader that you're supposed to be and belong to your own dream they want to take this dream away from you it's time to be brave Pisces it's time to face these demons head on no matter who or what or how they are because this person's willing to go all the way you gotta ask yourself are you or are you going to settle for whatever this is that they're offering that they think that you deserve? It's a test. It's always a test. It's always a choice. You can choose to stand your ground or you can choose to go to sleep. Go back to sleep. It's always a choice, my baby, baby sharks. And, and these people are desperately trying to get you to descend and give up your ten of pentacles and give up your spot you might even be physically moving Pisces but I do feel like you need to rest have hope use your wisdom to find the truth about this heartache about what they're causing they're trying to cause something about your heart something has to do with your heart that's the truth, the Spirit says. It's your light, your fertility, and this temptation of this Four of Wands in reverse. Giving up your stability, your foundations. Your triumph will be of the truth. You do have ancestor backing here. You have spiritual strength. Tap into it, Pisces. Tap into it. I mean, I can't tell you to keep fighting babies if you're tired. I, I know that you need to rest and I know that you need to rejuvenate. And you need to take that time for yourself. You really do. Shut off your, your computer. Shut off your, your phone. Shut it all off because that's what's affecting you. Shut it all off. Go find something else to do besides watching YouTube or, 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 or whatever. Even the TV is, is, is tainted. So, because these, these people are counting on it. They're counting on it. Everything's in reverse here except for the sacred union because this is what they're trying to stop. The dragon's duel. Lady of Lightning, shocking news. Sisters of the Season in reverse. Phoenix in reverse. Holy shit. These people are going down and they're trying to take you with them, Pisces. The Metal King, discipline, armor, and boundaries. Boundaries are super, super important right now. And like I said, I know you're tired, my babies. I know you're tired. Cut yourself away from the technology. I'm going to give you that heads up right now. Because when I do, I feel much better. When I'm online, I feel like somebody's squeezing my heart. And when I just quit doing everything and walk away from it, or listen to it in the background, I might keep it away from me and turn it on and do other stuff and listen to it in the background. I don't sit in front of it. Anytime I sit in front of it, I feel like somebody's projecting at me and they're trying to stab me in the heart. You can't take away my love. To my last breath, you will not take that from me. That is everything that I am as a human. And you can't have it. God gave that to me. And he's not going to let you take it either. 
He's going to give me the strength to keep going. Because that is the true test of faith. And my faith and my will is stronger. So mote it be. And that I make true. Three times three times three. Harming none and helping all is how it shall be. Okay, so. I guess it's over here. Thought it was on that page. The Metal King. 103. Check your Chinese zodiac. I'm the metal horse. So, um, like I said, you're going to have a hell of a time trying to kill my spirit. <laughs> Alright. So it says, be mindful of codependency and enmeshment. Enmeshment. So getting involved in all this bullshit. Like I said, get off the computer. When the Metal King comes as your challenger, he's inviting you to address how overwhelmed that you may be by other people. Do you pick up their feelings like you're like a sponge? Do you? Oh, that's such a Pisces thing. Do you feel the need to heal them so that you feel better? Get grounded. Be clear about your own personal boundaries and restrain yourself when you feel like jumping in and helping without being asked. This is also a warning against forming unhealthy relationships in any area of your life that these people are trying to force on you, Pisces. These people are trying to force this relationship down your throat because they want you to get you to take it so you, you settle for less than you deserve. And that solidifies any any kind of magic that they've been doing. Because after all, they bet their life on it, Pisces. That's why it's so hardcore for you. And, and you need to accept that, that they are what they are. Release it with love. Step away from the computer. Because that's how they're affecting your vibe. The dragon's duel takes place at the proverbial fork in the road. It's both an ally and challenger at once, as it represents the tensions of opposites. Even though the truth is that we live in unity, we experience the duality of faith and doubt and love and fear, right and wrong, black and white. This aspect of your current experience asks that although you to accept that although you may be going one way, another may call you to change directions. Now is the time to inquire whether it's your ego or your soul leading you. There are always choices in life, and decision making also solves inner conflict. If you're torn between two dragons, the one that you chose to feed will be the one that wins. And this is a vampire coming at you. Which is it? If it's not the one that serves the highest good of your intentions, deliberately feed the other, and the duel will be won in your favor. So intention is more powerful than attention. Although attention is the new currency, and that's what they get you to fall for. So like I said, this is like a, a bad Hollywood contract go wrong. You could settle for this, or you can choose to hold on for something better. It's up to you, Pisces. I know you're tired. But this person is this person's desperate. They have nothing to lose here. And they're trying to put you in the same position. Alright? I love you, my baby sharks. Please, please hang in there. And try to get away from the technology as much as possible. Alright? If you'd like a personal reading, my information is in the box below. And I know this wasn't a great reading, but please like, subscribe, and share. I would really appreciate it. Have a great rest of the day, and I'll see you uh, 
tomorrow for the live stream, Wednesday at 3 o'clock. Take care. Bye for now.